everybody to another episode of Movie Social. We are your hosts, Ricky and Stefan. Today's episode, we're going to talk about episode 8 of Snowpiercer. Yes, we're already up to episode 8. Two more to go. So, uh, sit back and enjoy the ride on the uh, express train. Alright, before we get into it, don't forget to uh, let us know what you guys thought about episode 8 in the comments below. And if you liked our show, give us a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe and turn on those notifications. Alright, episode 8 with Action Pat. Nah, stop action if you ask me. Did I say it? It was the best episode thus far of this season. I don't know what's to hold next week for the two hour season final, but this was a lot. It was the best episode. I mean, we finally seen the planning that took place in episode seven, put in action. Mm -hmm. They had the first class basically be their diversion without knowing they were the diversion. Basically set up uh, everything. Everybody now knows in first class that there is no Mr. Wolford. The uh, whole engine room situation is kind of crazy because you had one of the engineers who wanted to tell everybody which was stupid because then they don't need to put him in jail. The other engineer is like, no. And they are, he, him and the uh, child is now locked in the engine room. You know, what happens if they'll get them out, whatever happens with that. Uh, our Mr. Wolford, we found out, didn't actually make it onto the train at all. Yeah. People did meet him before getting on the train, so he was a real thing. We've come to find out what really happened finally. She left him at the platform, basically. Because of took off. Because of just basically, I mean, it was for valid reason, though. Yeah, I mean, she gave very valid well, reasons. If that is the case, because yeah. she's lied too many times, yeah, people if, really trust her. Agree. So. If if her actions were justified by the way that the kind of type of person that he was, understandable. Yeah, she did it for the good of everybody. I mean, I get what everybody else is thinking of what she said. Well, nobody else knows but one person at this time. Of her reason of why she left Wolford. Mm. I mean, it's hard for me to really believe it because you she lied about everything. Lied to everything, and now we just find out that you're not who you said you were, and you're basically running the show. And then you say, "Oh, well, he was this way." Yeah, I mean, it's hard for me to believe. We don't know what's going to happen to Melanie yet. Nope. I mean. Well, it looks like in the season final she might get broken out by Andre and the game, but we don't know. Got to see because now with all that action that happened <sighs> from the tail, <laughs> I'm just saying a lot happened. No, a lot happened, but like I'm, I'm, I'm thinking uh, I'm, about. I'm about to build up to this small part that I know you're saying about. Okay. But yeah, a lot happened with the tail marching into third class, third class helping out. They overthrown the guards, for the most part, killing a lot of guards in the battle. They lost a lot of people as well. Ah, that death. Some of the deaths were cowardly. Like, you really going to sl slice slices a woman's throat Took with an axe just for you to escape like a coward. Yeah. Shows the man that you are, but you wanted to overthrow Melanie from the train. Mm -hmm. That was a bitch move, Sam. Mm -hmm. that, was, that was a bitch move. Yeah. And then we find out they also took the man out the drawers, who's always playing this role. I should have known them putting him on the train <laughs> and then in the show was going to be that kind of role where he's going to double cross everybody. But I don't know. We don't know for sure yet. He might double, he might pretend to double cross the tail, but really set them up for failure. We don't know. That's going to be something to look out for. But as you can see my face right now, right? Well, I'm thinking, right? <laughs> Is last night I was as I was divulging into the scene, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> You've seen the picture time, right? Mm, yes, I'm okay. Lemonhead was in my brain the entire time. Unacceptable conditions. Unac Ill, if he betrayed the tale of I mean, right now we don't know what's going to happen because we know the tale still holds down up under the train as well a little bit. Yeah. They 
were reduced to pull back, but they still are holding down. Like, God damn, Man, they are shit. stupid. You're going to keep sending your men out there knowing they about to get shot up. Bro, I'm not sacrificing my men for this. Those, that contraption that they had was an awesome Yes, it was. I only would love to see that. Can we get this into, turned into a video game? Can we get this show turned into a video game? Because <laughs> they, be awesome. they had a barricade with like a, a section basically cut off. Put the machine there, machine barricaded that other part of it, and they was basically firing these spears that was like fucking from like ancient Greece. Yeah, it was like four spears out of time. Basically, they made the spears anywhere out of metal rods. And them just was going through people. Yeah. I like, feel bad for once that they instantly kill because like the ones where it was in their legs, legs and all that, they could so, move. Yeah. Whew. That's just, the fact that you sent them in there and kept sending them. I'm like, y'all are stupid. Now here's I'm my whole thing. My life for this. Now here's my whole thing, right? Mm-hmm. What if they had enough spirits to keep going? Exactly. Yeah, I know. Like, y'all just gonna keep sending everybody. Like, so everybody their, spirit, but they, their mindset is okay. We're gonna send, keep sending these people in here until they have no more spirits. But my whole thing is, well, what if they had enough? I mean, I know the original plan was okay. Yeah, we're gonna try and cut them off from the other side. And, Trap them in, so you got to keep them focused on what you're doing, thinking that, oh, no, uh, we'll be good. But no, y'all got ambushed anyway. <laughs> Cut the man's head off, had him in a box. I was like, that's my moments right there. Yeah, that was wild. That was wild. Was but I don't know. We're going to have to see how this all portrays, plays out, everything portrays in the final episodes on Sunday. So just. Just to pick a big off for you, next, off for next week. It's two more episodes, right? Yes. But they just combined it. Yep, it's a two hour season final. Okay. Ooh. Makes sense. Man, I don't know two hours can hold everything that's supposed to happen because we see why get why the final episode is called, what is it, 98 Nine, cards no, or 97? I mean, 994 cars long. Yeah, okay. So, because yeah. we see they're going to cut off some of these cars. Seven. Seven, because it's 1,001. Yeah, seven cards are getting cut off. We're going to see who's getting cut off, what part. Uh, this is going to be interesting. Are they cutting off Well, she did 994 it. cards, or are they cutting off seven cards? They're cutting off seven, cards. because... No, 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 I'm just saying, that's going to be the question. Oh, put it which end? Are we cutting from the engine? Seven cards from the engine off? And it's just the engine going on? Or are we cut, or cut off? Well, I mean, no, they need that's the engine. Gonna, I'm just saying, I'm though, I'm saying that has... First class had staying on and the rest of the train going by. It's going to be a question. Well, That's if I'm not mistaken, I know it's going to come down to Melanie helping the tail. Yeah, she to says it's train, cut the uh, other part off, but who's getting cut off? It's going to be a question. Yeah. That's going to, that's going to be, it's going to be so good. It's going to be so good. Like, I really, really might be on some fat shit next week and just like get some snacks with my bull puff. Oh, I'm going to binge and just be like, no, I'm talking about like, Ben I'm going to Ben G's. I watch this. And just like get some snacks and just like bang the snacks out. And I will watch be it. watching this completely sober, no alcohol whatsoever, because my eyes will be glued focused on this. Yeah, I mean, I, I normally don't watch uh, episodes of certain shows because I hate commercials. I really hate commercials. Like, if I'm watching something on HBO, there's no commercials, so I can watch that. But like, regular TV, like, what's it, TNT? TNT? Yep. It's commercials. I mean, it's limited commercials with this. I really wish it was no commercials, but oh well. Which will probably be the reason why we're not going to do a two-hour live stream. I would love to have done a live stream with the final two episodes together. Since it was going to be two hours, but eh. It is what it is. It's going to be action-packed, I know that. Very action-packed. Number eight, uh, episode eight was better than seven. It Mm -hmm. was better than five, and it was better than six. But, and it's like I said, man, like we said when we first started about this back in, if I'm not mistaken, was it March? It was what, April, May? Uh, this is May, May. May. That the first episode was, uh, far exceeded our expectations. And it just literally keeps up in the bar and up in the bar and up in the bar. Mm-hmm. Uh, and I just cannot wait for the season finale. But you know what episode 8 reminded me of? The Red Wedding. I don't want to talk about The Red Wedding, man. That was so painful to watch. This was painful. It wasn't so, painful. I mean, it was cheerful, but painful. Like all the deaths happening, the bloodshed. I get that. Because the red wedding was so. And I just imagine, imagine if this was on something like HBO. 
probably the amount of they, gore that they, they probably could have got a little bit more gruesome. This was wild. Probably would have seen one of those spear loops in my head if those ones be up. I'm just keeping it a bean. You probably would have seen something like that. No. You guys, what did you think of the episode? Did you love it? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Did, do you think uh, Mullen survives this season? Who do you think is going to get cut off from the train? Yeah, let us know. Uh, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. We'll see you next week. See ya.